Hello, this is Arif here, Love Joy, and today I'm doing a, I'm going to do a meditation. Um, it's a stand, standing meditation. So usually, um, you've probably seen in my previous videos or just people in general like to meditate, um, like most meditations are where you will sit down somewhere and sit comfortably and do your breathing and all that stuff. So this one is, you're literally doing the same thing, but not sitting down. So sometimes um, you, I don't feel like sitting down or you might don't want to sit down. Let's say you had a, a lot of food and you just don't feel like sitting down. Or for some other reasons, you just want to stand and you still want to do meditation or just be mindful and connect to your breathing and all that stuff. So that's why I do this a lot whenever... Let's say I have a meal, that's usually most of the time if I have food and then I want to sit down, then I'll just stand somewhere. I'll find a wall or something at the back. I can, I can, I'm mostly like leaning back to the wall. So, yeah, so I'll find a wall and just like kind of lean back a little bit, you know, not, not, not like, not, not like this, like more like a, I'm still like a straight, but just slightly leaning. And the goal is when you're really deeper into the meditative state so that you don't like lose consciousness or falling. You know, that's why it's very safe to just lean back a little bit. So, yeah, so you, I mean, I'll do the same thing when I usually do my meditation, which is just slowly breathing in from the belly and holding the breath for a few seconds and then let it go. So I'll do that for a few minutes. So this is pretty much it for standing meditation. And usually I like to close my eyes when I meditate. Breathe in. And hold. And let go. Breathe in. Let go. Breathe in. I usually like to just take a lot of air on my through my belly, like you know, try to like instead of like doing this, I'll like I'll do like so that I kind of fill up my belly with tons and tons of air. So it depends how much I need it. Sometimes I don't, or sometimes I do. So yeah. Just go with your own pace, do what feels good. The, the goal of the meditation or any kind of mindfulness or breathing exercise is that you really connect with your body so you know what you need. So, yeah, breathing in. And holding the breath. And let go. Breathing in. Holding and let go. When you are advanced, you're going to hold the breath longer and longer time. And you're going to exhale slowly and slowly. This is a little bit more advanced what I'm doing just because I've been doing this meditation or breathing exercise or mindfulness, whatever you call it, for almost 10 years so regularly. So I'm, yeah. So if you cannot do the same as I do, that's fine. The goal is just so that you take a few minutes out of your day and dive deep inside you with this exercise. They're very powerful. They changed my life. For better. <laughs> so yeah, let's keep going.
and after doing a few minutes like this you're going to feel really good really calm and just peaceful very fulfilling very satisfying as you can see i'm getting more and more calm and at peace it's not that i'm falling asleep not really no it's more like i'm becoming more and more relaxed consciously and this is extremely powerful when you can do this kind of experience i'm not sure which level you are um like a health wise or, or like a life wise how happy are you in life and um, this will make you extremely extremely happy this changed my life i suggest that you do it like five to ten minutes or 15 minutes a day like usually the sweet time is like five minutes to 30 minutes not longer than that because otherwise i mean unless you're doing some kind of meditation retreat this um, is, is amazing it really calms your mind and connects with your left and right atmosphere of the brain it's 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 amazing it's so powerful like i can't even describe in words how amazing this breathing exercises are or meditation or you know these days there's a lot of name like like some people call meditation some people say breathing exercise some people call it mindfulness or whatever you know that don't get caught in the name it's just like you're connecting with your brain and just connecting with your body and also like the environment around you the universe the nature or i call it like also that you're connecting with god too because this is very powerful very spiritual as well okay thanks so much for watching this is harry fear plus joy and hopefully you try this exercise thank you bye for now